What's up, my lovely Virgos? How's everybody doing? Let's see what's on and popping with my Virgos. If you're new to my channel, my name is Maya. If you like the vibe, if you like the energy, feel free to like and subscribe, okay? So let's see what's on and popping. Remember, everybody, this is not going to resonate to every Virgo. I could be picking up on a cross watcher that's watching for you. I could be picking up on a third party. I could be picking up on anybody that's watching the video. And also, I'm going to say the signs that are coming out. But if there's a sign, it's going to be from now on. That I feel like I see it. And it says that sign. And I feel like I'm picking up another sign in my head. I am going to say the other sign. Okay? So let's see what's on and popping over it goes. Because it could be anybody. Remember? Signs were never in um, Zodiac cards <laughs> back in the days. I see a beautiful girl right now with like curly hair, like that wide, really curly, 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 curly hair, like really curly. Black hair, but it's like that wideness of curly hair, beautiful curly hair. It's past her shoulders, but it's beautifully like done. Beautiful girl. I'm just seeing that right in my mind's eye right now. Brown eyes, beautiful girl with beautiful lips, almost like heart shaped lips, but a little bit puffy. I don't know who that girl is, but that per and she puts her hair, she has her hair like in the top with like two little pins or two little things like to grab it, like you know, like this. I don't know who that is, but I'm, I just saw it in my mind's eye. Might be a confirmation for somebody here, but very beautiful features in this girl's face, beautiful. My foot is going to go. It's going to start raining. Heard the thunder? All right, let's see. Mineta. Oh, God, here we go. <coughs> Mineta. What is the over energy for Virgo here? What else? That's a lot. Beautiful. Beautiful. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Virgos, what I'm picking up here is like, you know, it could be an offer that you're going to get and it's going to come out really good. So you're not going to be able to um, resist. But what I'm getting here is like two people are madly in love with here. Or we're madly in love with each other. There was so much love here given. And between two people, it was like a so many connections when I'm picking up here. Like a lot of love, you know, between each other. It's like I give you, you give me. I expect this from you. I, You know, you expect this from me. It's like a very giving couple or commitment or a person that's trying to get into a commitment right now. I see a skeleton for some reason in front of my mind's eye. Maybe somebody has a skeleton. Or maybe somebody likes skeletons here. But beautiful, beautiful energy I'm picking up here as I'm looking at the cards. But, you know, somebody here, you know, is in their inner power and in their inner strength. They're trying to build abundance. They're going to the abundance all the fucking way. You guys, whoever I'm picking up here, Virgo, you're not fucking around when it comes to abundance. You ain't fucking around when it comes to money. You ain't fucking around when it comes to stability. You ain't fucking around when it comes to get what you want, what you deserve, what you desire, what you need, and what you're going to get. Because I'm feeling like, you know, yes, there's a commitment here, and yes, there's people here that are together and they've broken up and there's a lot of karma coming into whoever here did something wrong either against you or you against another person there's a lot of karma coming in and there is going to be karma served here but like virgos what i'm picking up here this commitment is about to blow up or it's already you know transpiring or is a commitment that's been going on for a little while 
you might have had a problem with this person in the past or having problems now and there's a little bit of karma going to this person but what i'm picking up here is so much love so much strength so much inner strength a person that you know you feel comfortable with a person that you know you lay down on them and it's like you know you feel at home with this person you feel me and i feel like this person feels at home with you i feel like you know this and like i don't know i feel like it's a soulmate connection and i feel like there's been obstacles in the way you feel me like i feel like <clears throat> at some point this person either juggled cheated you know was just saying shit is juggling but i feel like you know they might have been flirting with several people or you caught them talking to people you don't want them talking to or you caught them in some type of fuckery but at the end of the day it's like you know you look at this person and it's like you just love this person you feel me you just love this person you know and you know whatever went on here Whatever energy I'm picking up here for these Virgos that I'm picking up right now, it's like, you forgave this person. Or you're going to forgive this person and you don't even know it yet. I feel like whoever did you wrong here, Virgos, whoever did you wrong when it comes to cheating or talking to somebody or even flirting with anybody or being, you know, in that type of environment or that type of shit going on, I feel like they served their karma already. You feel me? Or they're they're serving it right now. And I feel like, you know, you forgave this person for some of your Virgos. Or you're about to forgive. You want to forgive this person. You miss this person. This person misses you. You both miss each other. It's a love of a lifetime is what I'm picking up. A love that can never be broken. A love that comes from the universe. A, a love that was signed in to a contract here in this earth. And as much and Virgos, I'm gonna tell you right now, there's abundance coming your way very soon. And when I say very soon, you're gonna have so many offers in the plate, you're not gonna know which one to pick. Okay? There's a lot of offers coming in here. Beautiful offers for you, Virgo. My God. Like this is I love this shit right here. You have so many offers coming in, so much good luck coming in, so much, you know. Things that are going to transpire along the way, they're going to, you know, it could be work, it could be business, it could be, you know, it could be anything. And most of all, I feel like somebody here is psychic. I feel like somebody here is psychic, they're intuitive. I feel like somebody here, <clears throat> you know, could pick up things before they come and they still watch tarot. They don't care. They watch tarot anyways. I watch tarot as well. But I feel like there's so much abundance coming your way. And I feel like whoever's coming your way, <clears throat> they haven't come yet. They're going to rush in and they're going to give you the love you've never had in your fucking life. You're going to say to yourself, when you bump into this person, or this person comes into your life, if they're not already there, I've never been loved before how this person's loving me. It's like, you know, it's like a feeling of like, I've never been loved like this before. This is too good to be true, is what I'm picking up. This person and you are going to travel. This person and you are going to go do a lot of things. That your people are going to be like, <clears throat> I'm, she's telling me, se van a morir junto. And that's very rare, you know, because this is a Virgo reading. There's a lot of people, you know, a lot of people that are Virgos, but she's telling me, you know, two people here are going to die together, meaning it's going to last, it's going to last forever. No matter how many obstacles get in the way, <clears throat> no matter how many problems life brings to you, no matter how many things happen along the way, people getting in the way, not, be, not being able to move forward, you know, as fast as you want, you are going to die together. Okay, and if you're in a commitment here for a long time and you've been hitting a little things, you know, here and there and somebody, this, you know, your partner did you wrong and you forgave your partner, listen, you're going to move really really fast into abundance with this person there might be a baby coming through so be careful my virgo girls my virgo ladies and my virgo you know gentlemen out there there's a baby along the way so i don't know if somebody pregnant or somebody you know gonna get pregnant but there's a baby coming and i feel like you know there's an old 
person here, it's a spirit. It's a past loved one. That before this baby is born, is going to be taking care of this baby before it's even born. So I feel like in the soul, spiritual world, I feel like there's an old man here, an old person. It might be a father figure. It might be a grandpa. It might even be a great-grandfather. It might be even, you know, a female. But it's showing me a male energy. But this person has been taking care of this soul even before it's born. Even before, I'm not going to say born. Even before you create this child. And this is beautiful. This is amazing. This is stunning. This is this is out of this universe. You feel me? It's like this person is taking care of the soul before it even reincarnates, is what I'm trying to say. And you're going to see who this person is. She's telling me, You are going to be able to see the spirit. This spirit is going to show themselves to this past loved one that's here, whoever it is in your family. It could be in the other person's side's family. They're going to show themselves. They were very loyal when they were alive. Very structured person. Very strict. Very loyal. But, you know, you could work your way into this person. You feel me? Very strict, but you could work your way in there with your little charm and get this person to soften up a little bit. They were very strict. Very structured. A person that grew up very, very structured in their lifetime. You feel me? <laughs> A lot of loyalty coming in here for you, Virgos. I'm very happy for this. A lot of loyalty. A lot of different options. So you have a lot of options to pick up. You know, you're going to have, you know, from here to there, there, here, everywhere. You're going to have options coming in. You know, dates, invitations. You know, let me get your number. You know, can I vibe with you? You know, I like you. You know, in the work everywhere, you're going to have options if you're not already having it. Somebody here is serving karma. It could be you, Virgo, that you're serving karma right now for some things from the past, you know, past lifetimes, this this life. It doesn't matter. But somebody here, and I feel like it's your partner, but also Virgo. Some Virgos are serving karma here. But it's time to move forward. It's, I feel like it's time, whoever's going to pick this up, and I hope it's everybody, you served your karma already. Or you're about to end your karma. Because beautiful things are coming your way. This is beautiful right here. Look at this. In the bottom of the deck, the Six of Pentacles. You know? Money, gifts, abundance, success is going to come to you out of nowhere. Okay? So the universe is in here with you, Virgos. Let me see. Mineira, what else here for my Virgos? What else? The Queen of Cups. The Page of Cups. This is a beautiful reading. Like I'm telling you, love is coming in here. You've been waiting for love for a very long time. You've been waiting to be loved how you're supposed to be loved. You've been waiting, you know, to be nurtured the way you want to be nurtured, to be treated the way you want to be treated because you had someone before that offered you something, but it was nothing. It was just, you know, playtime, fun time. It wasn't a stable thing. It was actually a person that's serving karma right now, too. But let me tell you something. There's a lot of energies here, beautiful energies here. There's a lot of things going on here around you, Virgo, that you might even realize that if you're feeling weird, if you're feeling like what's happening, if you're feeling like something bad's going to happen and you're feeling it in your stomach, in your gut, in your chest, that's nothing bad. Beautiful things are coming your way. Success, family, children, abundance, money. I mean, I see you with a home. I see you in a very warm home. I see you in love. I see you so in love that it's like the world around you doesn't exist anymore. That's how beautiful I'm seeing this reading and I'm picking up the energy. It's like giving me chills down my back. It's like some spirit. I don't know if this is the spirit or is my ancestor touching me, but it's coming down my back. Like, my God, like, Virgos and whoever here left you or you left they served their karma already and I feel like this person's gonna come back to you and you're gonna forgive this person you're gonna you love this person this is like a soulmate connection a contract was signed here yes I see 
Virgos here that got cheated on. And I see Virgos that cheated as well. You want to cheat on me, I want to cheat on you. But this can be fixed, okay? As long as there's no physical, and I always say it, or mental abuse, it could be fixed. But this right here, whatever you went through in the past, it has served its way. It has left. It has left. It stayed behind. You're moving forward and you're moving beautifully. I see so much gold. I don't know if somebody is wearing a lot of gold or somebody likes gold, but I see a lot of gold. And when I say gold, I'm seeing gold in front of me, like they were showing me gold. Or my ancestors are showing me gold, like if somebody's going to get rich here. Or somebody is rich or somebody's about to get rich. But you, I don't know, man. There's a lot of abundance coming in here for you guys. Virgo, Virgos, damn. Mi negra. Ma ferifun egun todo y luz y progreso para ti, mi negra. Let me see. I'm just praising her in Spanish, my ancestor. Mi negra, what else is coming towards Virgo? What else is the energy here for Virgo? Your money problems are going to go away. The five of pentacles in reverse. I'm telling you, Virgos, I cannot make this shit up. My, look at this in the bottom of the deck. I cannot make this shit up. You don't know how much amount of wealth. And when I say wealth, I'm not saying you're going to become a millionaire, nothing like that. The wealth, the success, the beautiful times, the beautiful energies, the life you're going to live. Comfortable is what I'm trying to say. You're not going to need nothing from nobody. At all. This is so beautiful. Like, this is like... I'm going to put that Ace of Pentacles on the table. That is the biggest card of abundance. Virgos, you're getting it all. You're getting it all. I mean, there's nothing else to put down the table. You're getting it all. And somebody here that did you wrong or that did you dirty or that has been hating on you and wishing that you don't get abundance and wishing that you don't get success and wishing that you don't be with somebody that you really love that was with this person because I'm already picking it up. Somebody here was somebody that is the love of your life and that you were both in love and somebody here was with this person and they're wishing a lot of bad on you. They don't want the success. They don't want the abundance. They don't want you with this person because they know that you two together are a power couple. This person is going to serve karma like a motherfucker because at one point in time, it could have been yesterday, it could have been the day before yesterday, it could have been last week, it could have been last year. There was something done to you not to be with this person, but you're coming together. And if it's somebody you know, damn, Virgos. This is so fucking beautiful. You need to claim this video because the abundance is so beautiful. It's coming in. And it's not only the abundance. It's the light over you. The energy is going to be so clear, so beautiful. You're going to be able to smell it, taste it, live it, walk it, talk it. I mean, you're going to be able to even smell the air different because I'm smelling it. It's like a sweet, soury taste. It's almost like a, <clears throat> like a citrus citrus type of like um smell you know that i'm smelling but also with air in it it's like a it's like a very difficult smell that i'm smelling but i know it feels beautiful in the air it's like you're gonna see things more clearly all the fogginess that you've been seeing because i feel like somebody has been seeing fogginess around them it's because something beautiful is coming your way some fog is moving around some spiritual energy of yours or some ancestors moving fog around to let you see the light this is beautiful this is amazingly beautiful the ace of pentacles in the bottom of the other deck you have no idea virgos how much and this could be don't get me wrong, Virgos, because this could be, you know, a year from now, two years from now, three years from now. It takes time to build abundance. It takes time to build success. It takes time to build a beautiful connection. It takes time. You know, it takes work. But this right here, it ain't stopping. Whoever's going to hit this, it ain't stopping. And if you, ain't, if you don't even know what I'm talking about, claim it. Claim it to my ancestor. Claim it to your ancestors. 
you're going to get it. The Ace of Pentacles in the bottom of the deck that I just pulled out. Beautiful, beautiful energy. It's like you're going to be seen everywhere. You're going to know, be known everywhere. I feel like there's a public recognition coming in. Or something that you're going to be rewarded from. And the world is going to see this. And when I say the world is because you could be, you know, be on the news, YouTube, in a newspaper, something like that. But something is going to be given to you and it's going to be recognized by a lot of people. Whoever here has access to the beach or any type of salt water, you need to get to that salt water. Pour a little bit of salt water behind your neck, around your arms. Behind your legs, where the knees go. And around the front of your chest and your arms. And give thanks to Yamaya. For the abundance and the success and the love that you're about to receive. Okay? If you don't know what that means, ask me in the comments and I'll tell you how to do it. Let me see. What else is coming? Mi negra. egung. I love this. What else is coming towards Virgo? It could be past, present, or future. The tower in reverse. <clears throat> the moon. And the knight of wands. Listen, somebody here that you were dealing with in the past caused you a lot of towers, caused you a lot of chaos, caused you a lot of problems, caused, a, caused you a lot of fights in your home. Your home was reckless is what I'm hearing. There was a lot of secrets hidden, you feel me? But those secrets are coming out to the light. They're going to come out to the light. Get ready because those secrets are coming out to the light. There's somebody here that wants to destroy your happiness and your success. They're not going to be able to. Just like the light is shining on her while she's looking away, you're going to be looking right at the light. You feel me? And I don't ever look at the cards and say that, but that card just stood up to me so beautifully. But... There's so much rain of fucking success and beautiful energy raining on you. Um, I was going to say Libras. Maybe it's a Libra that you're going to deal with, you're dealing with, you have it in your chart because I was going to say Libra. But there's so much beautiful energies here. It's like you're leaving all the garbage behind. The Eight of Cups in the bottom of the deck. You're leaving what no longer serves you behind. You don't give a fuck. You don't give three fucks. It's like you don't care anymore. You're moving forward. And I think you've earned it, Virgo. Because she's telling me, Ego solo merece. You deserve it. Whoever here has been, you know, been through hell, been through hard times since a child, has, you know, been through a lot where I see. I don't want to talk about it because I'm looking at the good stuff. But I see a lot of pain here. Whoever's been through this and has kept on moving and not giving up, you're getting it all. You need to claim the fuck out of this reading. Beautiful. I see weddings here. I see so much beautiful things happening here. I see traveling here. I see a big, big mansion here for some reason. So if somebody here is going to buy a house, you might even end up in a two-story mansion. A three-story mansion. I'm telling you, abundance is coming here like a motherfucker. And all these towers... You're breaking them down. Your ancestors, your guides, your past loved ones, and maybe even this past loved one I'm picking up on here that's specifically for somebody, they're breaking these towers. They're helping you break these towers because you've been through a lot, a lot of pain, a lot of lies. If you've been seeing feathers, a lot of feathers fall for no reason. They come from nowhere and you don't know where they're coming from. It's a confirmation from your spiritual guides. You're moving beautifully. I cannot say anything else about this reading. <clears throat> Let me see. What else here? We need uh, for Virgo. Look, I cannot make this shit up. I cannot make this shit up even if I motherfucking tried. Virgos, you're getting a fucking mansion. Not for every Virgo, but I wish and I pray and I hope. And we're all going to pray that it's for every Virgo. And whoever has Virgo on their chart. You're going to have a beautiful home, a home to walk into with warmth, stability, prosperity, abundance. You know, a home that you can walk into and relax. Uh, it doesn't have to be a mansion. You know what I'm saying? But my God, like, man, you went through a lot. 
poverty is in the bottom of the deck. You've been through a lot. A lot when it comes to money and pushing forward and not being able to get help. Nobody helping you do it on your own. You're being rewarded for this. You feel me? Beautiful. Look at this. Beautiful home. Warmth in it. Stability. Beautiful home. Let me see what else for Virgo Mineira. Community. Listen, you're going to have beautiful... Listen, you're going to have a beautiful neighbors, a neighborhood, like beautiful people around you. Like wherever you move or wherever you're planning to move, wherever you're planning to travel, that you're going to rent a house or buy a house, whatever it is, the community there is going to receive you with so much love that you're not going to know what the fuck hit your face. Because you're used to seeing only the fuckery. You're going to have people there to offer you, to help you, to receive you, and give you, like, you know, I'm not going to say love, because, yeah, but love, is, love is okay to say. From the neighbors, like, the community, you're going to have a beautiful community you're going to live in. Neighbors to trust. They're going to be watching your children. You know, not. I'm not going to say that you're going to leave your children with them, you feel me? But a beautiful energy around the whole neighborhood, okay? I see two black men here very high power very high power that for some reason are coming out here so i don't know who's the ceo of a company here and it's a black male or two black males that work together it could be brothers or something or you could be a ceo or you could be in a, in a position where you want to go up and it's not happening for you, you're going up. And somebody's going up with you. It could be a friend, it could be a co-worker, it could be a brother, it could be something. You might even own your own business and have a family member go up with you. And it's a black man that I'm seeing. Beautiful energy. I love this. Let me see what else for Virgo's Mineira. Because what else can I say? This shit is so beautiful. Mineira, what else is coming out here for Virgo? courthouse listen you might be going to a courthouse to sign papers to get married you might be going to the courthouse to settle something you haven't settled you might be getting you know an inheritance you might be getting you know a lawsuit who knows but there's papers to be signed here in a courthouse there's papers here to be signed and it might be a, a sign off of a house okay even a marriage it doesn't matter, but it's coming out good. It's nothing bad that I'm picking up. Whatever it is, is good. And whatever is worrying you here, and whoever's serving karma here, they might be going straight to the courthouse and from the courthouse straight to jail. Because somebody here is serving karma for fucking you up. And I feel like there's a lot of parents here involved as a child. They might be getting karma. And they might be serving justice inside of a jail. Or might be having to do something illegally. Not illegally. My bad. Something that, you know, they need to fix. And they're not going to be able to fix it. It's going to be not good for them. Whoever serving karma here might just end up in jail. Or in a situation where the courthouse is not going to be good for them. Because of all the shit they did too. And I feel like it's coming from really past energies. Some of them are, yeah, exes and shit like that. But I feel like, you know, there was a family here that, you know, left their children out in the cold. Didn't do anything for their child. Didn't help. Didn't give them advice. Didn't, you know, guide them the right way. You feel me? And I feel like somebody was adopted here too. Or was not raised by their mother or their father. This person is going to serve major karma because this person has been controlling you all your life. Let those motherfuckers serve that karma. That's not your problem. You're moving forward. And I see marriage. I see I see so many things here, man. It's so beautiful. Oh my God. Let me see the signs. You could be dealing with a Gemini, a Libra, Aquarius, another Gemini, a Leo. My God, there's so much air here. Uh, Gemini, Aquarius, a uh, Libra again, Capricorn, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio again, Libra, 
Gemini, Aquarius, my God, Pisces, Aries. There's a lot of air and a lot of earth here, okay? Let me see. What is the message here? For my Virgos, Mineira. The spread. What else? Any other messages here for Virgo? Look, right there, your card just came up. Anything else from my Virgos? That's it. Pineda, anything else here for my Virgos? Anything else? One more. My Virgos. That's it. Let's see. <clears throat> okay, it says keep yourself guarded. Don't give your energy just to anyone. Spirit. So keep yourself guarded. Stay to yourself. Don't tell nobody your business. Don't tell nobody what's coming towards your way. If you meet somebody and you hit that beautiful chemistry, that beautiful connection, that beautiful love, that beautiful warmth, if you're, you know, you're going to buy a house, if you're going to move, whatever it is that you're doing, keep it to yourself, okay? And keep yourself guarded because somebody who wants to stop this, so keep yourself guarded and just keep to yourself. Don't let no, no energies come in, okay? Meaning, if you meet somebody too, you feel me? You have to feel that connection. You have to feel that chemistry. You won't know who's the one. Trust me, because she's telling me, Tu has a king. You're going to know who it is. I haven't found happiness with anyone else. Somebody's missing you here. Oh, well. Maybe it's that person that wants to come back, that served their um, karma, or they're serving their karma, and you might forgive this person. I can't forget you no matter what I do, that you put a spell on me. This person is losing it they miss you this might be the person that you want to forgive or that you're going to forgive and you don't even know right now because i feel like you know she's telling me they're going to say hey, well, let's see. It's not so you. like she's telling me that some people are going to say here that's not me you somebody here's going to forgive somebody spells broke this connection haters in your circle <laughs> i cannot make this shit up you got a hater here Spells broke this connection in the past. I think I said it earlier. I'm not sure. But somebody here is coming together. Somebody here is coming back together. That spells broke your connection. And there's haters still in your circle. So be careful who you let in your energy. I'm toxic and everybody around me. But I will never say it. Old patterns. This person that you were dealing with in the past. That I saw in the beginning that I don't want to talk about. They were always toxic. They worked with old patterns. And I want to talk about that because it's a good reading. That's in the past. They're serving their karma. But be careful with these haters around you. You needed to go through this. To move forward with clarity. It's your choice now to remove yourself from any bad situation. Your choice is not a mistake or anyone's. So whatever you went through. As an adult, not as a child. Whatever you went through. Whatever you were going through, whatever you were letting yourself get involved in, whatever you were not removing yourself from in the past, you had to learn so you can move more with clarity. Like I said, you're going to see clarity. You're going to smell it. You're going to feel it. Now it's your choice to move yourself from all these bad situations. So whoever comes in with this hating energy, all these fucking people, like, like it says, don't give your energy just to anyone. Stay away from everybody and keep to yourself. You want to hold me down? I'm coming for you. I cannot make this shit up. Somebody here going to get together again. Whoop. Whoop. There it is. Whoop. There it is. I'm telling you, I'm getting excited because somebody coming back. I don't give a fuck what happened with y'all. I don't give a fuck if somebody cheated. I don't give a fuck what happened here. They served their karma. They love you. You love them. There's a soulmate connection. This could be fixed. If it was not physical or mental abuse, somebody here belongs together. It was signed in a contract before moving into this earth. I'm moving. Really, bro? 
Well, let me know when y'all moved and when, what, what furniture you brought with you so I could see when I moved. Because who the fuck would say that? But I'm excited. Like, damn. Somebody here is going to come for you, bro. And if it's somebody new, they coming. They want you to hold them down. Meaning, they coming and they taking no for an answer. Virgo, claim the fuck out of this motherfucking video. This read, because this is, this is beautiful. This could be first, middle, last initials for you, this person, whoever you think is coming, whoever came, whoever left. I don't know whoever you're thinking about. Even this past loved one that came through, that's very, very beautiful energy. That's taking care of a soul baby that's coming through. Beautiful energy. I love this reading. This, I think this is the most beautiful reading I've ever done in tarot on YouTube. You have an N here, which could also be a U. You have an R here. You have an A. You have an M, which is also a W on spiritual dices. You have an O. You have another N, which is also a U. That's doubles. You got a T. You got an A, another A double A's already you got a V here you got a V you got a K you got a K you got a T that's another T double T already you got another W which could also be an M in spiritual dice this is doubles already too you got a J here hidden in the back you got a J you got an F. Okay, and you got an E. All right, so let's flip. Let's flip, y'all. Let's flip. I love this. All right, you got UN as a double. You got A as a double. Let me flip and see what I can get you. I don't know, but I just seen a bunch of uh, guys in front of me dancing in tuxedos, doing this weird, funny dance. Like, if they weren't in a, in a my God. What do you call that place? Like in a in a reception area or uh, something that was rented dancing and there's like four guys in suits just dancing, like having fun with it. I mean, they didn't know how to dance, but whatever. They're having fun. I've seen that in my mind's eye. Okay, you got another U, which could also be an N, all right? Which is, that's doubled again. You got a straight and an M here. All right, so you got... Um, W twice, you got T twice. And you got, let me just flip these and see what I can get you because they're doubles. All right, so you got um, another E. And you got another N with, another, with a Z. It could also be a Z. So you got this U over here, which is also an N, which is doubles. And you got um, double E again. So I'm going to flip it and see what comes out. Okay, you got an R. That's double R already. And you got an L. Let me flip that last R, which is doubled up, and see what I get you. You got another R. I wanted to stay in R, so that's significant. Virgos, I am so happy for you. Keep it moving. Don't stop. Claim the fuck out of this video because everything that you want is coming towards your weight and more. I love you all. I'm going to wish you the best of luck, and I'll see you later, my loves.